So I've been experimenting with something that, I don't know what I'm going to call it, but basically it's like a, a no solder LED. You push it in, in here, and the idea is you kind of loop it over like a, sort of like you're sewing something. It loops in and out, and then you loop it over. A little uh, 0 0.8 millimeter PCB CR2016 battery, or it could be a 2032. It just slides in. Now, the overall idea is that I can make some sort of switching circuit. This was my idea originally. It's a guitar pick, and I may still do something with this. The problem is that it makes a good contact with the positive here, but the negative does not make that good contact until you press on it. So you can see there, this little thing acts like a switch. Basically like a, a no solder and no switch, basically no no components besides the LED and the power source. A little light. Got several versions here. Actually looks kind of cool. Looks like a um, District 6 or whatever. You know, like the, the aliens. Good pull. Obviously you don't know how, how hard I'm really pulling, but it is very secure there. And hopefully if it makes good conduction, you know, it'll be a good thing. I need. So this was more or less the final result, at least for now, of the LED no solder with a CR2032 battery. It takes a bit of force to make it turn on. And with a two CR2016, which is, is thinner, it's actually 20 millimeters in diameter and 1.6 millimeters in width. Very light touch. In fact, you could almost use it as a vibration sensor, which is, well, can't quite do that. But, you know, if it was maybe on the underside of a drum or something, maybe it would light up. I haven't tested it yet. Obviously, you can use these as a light. Lights light up. You can look around with it. Same thing with that. You could do, you know, you could do some sort of more Morse code with it. You could. Doo -doo 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 -doo. It's also got a ruler on the on the back, so if you want to check that out, these squares are supposed to be one inch square, so that would be about 25 millimeters and 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, right on. So that's that's good. Yeah, and you can also put it on the keychain, so that's that's pretty neat. So pretty pretty cool. So lots of different uses for this, but one thing that I thought was kind of interesting kind of came full circle. Just kind of on a whim, I thought, well, maybe I could try actually drumming a guitar with that. But I thought, well, why not just try it with my baritone ukulele, which is more or less a four-string guitar. You can see here, it lights up. So, kind of cool. It shows where your fingers are if you do it that way. And so yeah, I'm still kind of uh, experimenting with that. So let's see, like that. that or like so hope you enjoy i'll do a little little concert after this but uh other than that this is jeremy cook signing off